Okay, we're back and we're with a Super Mario 3D World tips and tricks video. Once again, here we go. So in part one, I showcased a lot more things than this video. So anyway, in this video, it's transportation and what else is it? Toad houses. Not how to get easy power ups. <laughs> First thing I'm going to be showing you is a level on World 4 called Piranha Creeper Creek. It's, I would say a secret, I think it is a secret, you, know, you would class it as a secret. But if you get to a point and then climb up a wall, there's a pipe where you can walk to the next world. I'm not sure why you want to do that because you've got a photo to say, but anyway. Join my Discord server, link in description. So you have to take that pipe and then you're up here. So I would recommend getting a katsu, but just do what I did and then you'll be up there. So there's a pipe here. If you go down there, boom. See, I don't know why I'd want to do that because the fairy's right there, but... And that clear pipe won't be there because there would be no fairy. The next thing is, if you walk on down here, there is a pipe for me, but there should be stones for you. If you click A on the stones, it will make the pipe. And then you come over here, there should be two more stones. This first one, it takes you all the way back down to World 1. It's just a quick transport. So if you take the other pipe, it will take you to a cool, like, golden train. Uh, I've already done it, and I think it's only a one-time use. So I'll try to put a picture on the screen, show you what it looks like. And I would say you get a lot of coins from it. A lot. Anyway, the other pipe at the end brings you to the World 3 boss fight. So now the best thing of all time in Mario is power-ups. So, where I just jumped, that was where Mushroom House is. And this little hedge thing, that, that is a toad house. I don't think it's... I think it can be used more than once, I'm not sure, I can't remember. Anyway, on to World 2. So, that one you see down there was not one, that was a stamp. But if you go in this pipe, there's a Mushroom House. So now going back through the pipe, this isn't a toad house. This is a cheeky little secret power-up thing, if that's what you want to call it. You can see it right there. There's a one-up hiding right behind here. Grab that, and then you've got an extra life. World 3, I didn't even notice this until today. So if you go in this pipe after completing 3-5, go in there, you see this race map Mario Kart thing. There's stones on the floor. If you press A on that, the pipe will appear and then you've got a whole view of world 3 plus an extra life i didn't know about that i only just found that out going back through that pipe and back through this one after the mario kart level walk over a bit and you should see another pipe there you do have to complete 3 7 but or if that's something else i don't know there is one here but i did use it i can't remember when but apparently it was recent so uh, the circles, circle patches of grass, that is a mushroom house. And the star is a stamp one, just so you don't get confused. Now moving on to world four. So there is that pipe there, but that just gives you a view of world four. This mushroom house is right there, easy to spot. I'm pretty sure that is the only one. On world five, there is one right in the open, but you do have to complete 5-3 in this pipe, it's on this separate little island. And yeah, I think that's the only one in this world as well. World 6 is basically the same as World 4 with the Toad House. It's literally out in the open. Uh, you do have to complete 6-7 for it to open there. World Castle, once again, literally out in the open. The other side is a stamp, by the way. So you have to complete this level in order to do it. And yeah, this once again is the only one in World Castle. World Bowser, there is, once again, another one out in the open. You have to complete this Plessy level, but 
it's not the only one in the level. There is a secret which I also just found out about. You see this little passageway? You can actually go in there. When I said you can go in there, I did mean the Toad House. But anyway, for now, that is the end of the video. But next time, I have a good idea for a video. Champions Road, or just World Crown in general, how to play it the raspy way. Because some people struggle with Champions Road. Because who doesn't on their own? Because with four people, it's so easy. Oh, just one person. Holy. But anyway, I don't know when, but I'll make a world crown video. Not how to do it, how to play it. Not how to do it, but how to do it my way and how I did it. Because personally, I find that easier. Although I have never seen one, so it's just my way. But yeah, there could be some better ways, but I don't know. I'll just show you how I did it. And yeah, that is the end, so toodle.